Well, this is a little bittersweet, isn't it? Uh, does anybody recognize where we are? Yeah, this... This is the latest save that I have available to me of our world. And this area is where we're building our city, our castle. Uh, if you don't recognize this, because a lot of terraforming had been done. Um, these little mountains had been torn down. There used to be a wall all along here. Uh, there was a gatehouse right around here. A lot of work has been lost. But on the bright side, I am back. Hello, everybody. Welcome to... I don't even know what episode we're on because it's been so long since I've recorded an episode. Uh, this is about... I think this is my first episode in about three weeks. So for those of you that haven't followed me on Twitter, haven't seen my latest video, what happened? Uh, my old computer died on me is what happened. The motherboard died and it took my uh my hard drive with it. So um I lost all the files that was on it. My other hard drive I salvaged but it, it didn't have a very recent save on it. Um and I wasn't able to buy a computer, a new computer uh right away. Um but I, I did and by the way link in the description of my new parts. This thing is pretty beefy it is a beast um <laughs> i am really happy with this thing um normally on my okay on my put to put in perspective on my old computer running shaders like this would have had me at around 35 40 fps at like 12 render distance um i have my render distance on far um and or on similar settings i was running about 300 fps um with these sh with the like highest shaders on um oh i'm still in creative oops so yeah the short story is um videos are going to be a lot better now because i'm not going to be limited by my computer anymore before i felt like i was pretty heavily limited um i was not able to play a lot of the games i wanted to play so expect more um, like AAA games and whatnot, uh, I can record in uh, shaders just fine and, you know, get 100 FPS. Um, it's exciting. Uh, but we lost this area, so that's a little sad. Um, I also lost the creative world that we just started, but that was just one episode, and that's fine. Um, so I, uh, I had to make some decisions about this world, like, Really, this save that I, that I picked out, this is the amount of food that I had on it. Um, okay, that shadow is really ugly. <laughs> Why is that cast a shadow? It's light. Uh, yeah, this world, I, I had to decide, like, what am I going to do now that... Um, ha! Look at that. Now that we've lost what we had put quite a bit of time into, like, what... What do I do with this world? Uh, so, basically, I think what I've decided is we're still going to build in this world. We're not going to lose this world or anything. But these big projects, like building a city like we were going to, I think I'm going to reserve that for our creative series. That's what that series is for, building things that aren't really realistic. Well, I mean, it was realistic. It just would have taken forever. And... I don't know how fun it would have been to watch over 50 episodes of me building a city. Um, so what I'm aiming for is that we can maybe do smaller projects, kind of like this Orc Stronghold. I did that in about seven episodes, I think, and it's one of my favorite projects. If I could do something like that every five to ten episodes, uh, you know, we could get a real good collection of, of projects in this world, and I'd be really happy with it. So I... I, that's not to say that we won't build another town in this world. Um, but in the near future, I think I'm going to be looking at doing smaller one-off projects. I'm I'm thinking that I'm still going to follow our story that we had been running. Because um, I, I kind of have plans for the next build on what to do. Um, this looks beautiful. 
I'm just kind of admiring how everything looks. The planes and shaders just looks awesome. Uh, so yeah, um, computer's running great. I, I built it all on my own, which I'm very proud of because I'm kind of an idiot when it comes to computers and not screwing stuff up. Uh, I've actually had it built for a few days. And I've just kind of been playing and enjoying it um, without making videos. And I can't say that I have seen a, seen a frame drop a single time while I've been playing with everything on like ultra settings and everything. Uh, I, I game at 1080p, so uh, can you please stop? So stop making those noises. Uh, so th this graphics card, the 1070, it should be running pretty much every game at 1080p around 100 FPS um, on ultra settings. You know, it depends on the game, but uh, that's more than enough, so I'm pretty happy with that. Um, only thing that I still need to upgrade or buy or whatever, I need a camera. Um, you know, you guys know that I like to live stream. I like to put my face where you can see it. Um, I don't have a camera right now, um, so that's going to wait till next payday, I suppose. Um, but that'll be my next my next purchase, I think. You know, what's really a bummer is we lost a decent bit of stuff. I had built a fish farm. Just making sure it's not there. <laughs> I had built a fish farm into the side of this right there. And we'd gotten mending and put it on a an elytra. Maybe I'll just cheat and put mending on elytra. Because I'm kind of sad that we lost that. We got to go to bed. Where's my be bed? <laughs> um, So that kind of sucks. Uh, but other than that, I kind of want to remember this area with something. So we're going to build a bit of a memorial for it. Um, I need, let's grab glowstone. Oh, I don't know why I grabbed what I grabbed. I need a diamond block. Ooh, we do not have many diamond blocks. <laughs> I'm paying the price for this. For this monument that we're gonna build. You can find a good spot for this. I kind of want it out in the open and this was the area that we had built in. Our gate that we had built and our houses were right about here. So I think we could build it here. Let's put down some dirt. I want this to grow into grass so let's do that right away. Now, this isn't going to be a super fancy monument, but it's going to get the job done. People are going to know when they see it that, hey, this is important. This will be something cool to come back and visit in the future and come back to this monument a year down the road and say, hey, this is this is that city that we worked on for a hundred hours and then lost because hey guys back up your stuff on a separate hard drive <laughs> i i just i just backed it up on the same hard drive thinking that would be enough um no not at all so how's everybody been i do have quite a few new subscribers since uh since we left off which was surprising i thought that um activity would be pretty pretty dead but that didn't seem to be the case um me, I picked up a new job, so I'm working two jobs, and this might interfere with videos and whatnot, because currently, I'm working a lot. Stop making those noises. Um, there were there was a two day stretch uh last week where I worked 32 hours in two days, and you know what? There are people who do that all the time. My mom works like 70 hours a week. It just makes me respect that all that much more because I was miserable. <laughs> um, all right, so let's start this off pretty basic. Go all the way up. Let's let's go. How do we want to go? Let's put the glowstone here. Let's get a crafting bench and. Just go right there for now. Um, you know what? Let's use the block that I never use. I never use these stone slabs. 
but I think they're gonna go okay right here. So let's do one of these deals. Oh, you know what? Let's grab some more. I got some ideas for this. I really don't have a plan. I'm just kind of building as I go. You know, that's kind of like, reminds me of the good old days of Minecraft. Um, for me, just, just playing and not planning. It's so much planning now, and and sometimes I if, if I feel not like it ruins the game, but it gives the game a different feeling um, when you're when you're planning and not playing. Like sometimes what you build doesn't need to look good. If you just build and you have fun and things look ugly, but you're happy anyway. That's like that's what Minecraft used to be, right? Uh, I miss those days of not knowing how to do anything or not knowing the limits of the game and whatnot. Um, who knows? Maybe the next update will bring uh, more exciting stuff. You know, I'm hoping for a builder's update. I actually, I I sent a DM to um, one of the uh, devs of the of of the Minecraft team. I forget. It was Mark. Um, I sent a DM to Mark because he tweeted out that he opened up his DMs and I tweeted him a compliment saying uh, like just something nice um, just uh, you know be to be nice I guess um, and he commented oh thank you and I said with that being said builders update a riot <laughs> and he never responded <laughs> probably wasn't that funny but I'm sure I got him thinking about that builder's update. Uh, let's not... Well, actually, let's use that. Different material. Why not? Let's just go like this. This is kind of an ugly... Oh, no, I didn't want that. It's kind of an ugly monument. But, you know... Maybe I don't like these little wingy, wingy thing thingies coming out so far. Let's do one of these deals. How do you guys like the shaders, by the way? Like, should I keep them? There are light shaders and extreme shaders. I'm using Chocopic for anyone that's interested, by the way. Um, and I honestly can't tell a huge difference. The extreme shaders seem a little bit more washed out, um, which is a problem with shaders, to be honest. Um, I feel like we could do something more. You know what, let's... Put some spruce in here. Do I have spruce on me? Of course I don't. Let's farm up this tree. Thank you. And let's just give it a little bit more uh, contrast. Let's make some stairs just in case. I don't really know what I'm doing. I usually don't know what I'm doing, but I hide it better. See, I'm not a good builder. I just hide the fact that I don't know what I'm doing. I give you some logic behind what I do, and you guys are like, yeah. <laughs> Wait, that was a... Oh, that was a half slab. Um, let's get rid of that. Let's do something like this. And... I suppose... We could do... This... It kind of looks like a magic blue lantern, uh, but it's not. I mean, it. I guess it does give off light. Doesn't it give off light? Light goes through those transparent blocks, right? Like, I know you can see it, but does it actually affect the light value? For some reason, I can't remember. It should. Um, I feel like some... Some uh, fence could do us some good. Now let's see if I can remember how to make fence. Ooh, can I find fence? No, of course I can't. Um, I'm doing it the wrong way, aren't I? Am I doing it the wrong way? Oh, sweet. I didn't do it the wrong way. That is shocking. So yeah, getting back to the regular schedule. I'm honestly look, uh, looking forward to putting in extra time into our creative series. 
There are some games that were shown at E3 that I'm really excited for. Um, like, uh, there's not really a good way to do this because of the way I'm using these half slabs. Um, I don't know if I like that. Like, a lot of you guys know I'm into cars. I'm really excited for Forza 7. I said 700 cars. Like, holy crap, that's a lot of cars. I hope it's not just like... 200 cars painted differently, though. There have been games. Isn't Gran Turismo did that? Something like that. Uh, let's put... Okay, let's get rid of these. Let's... Oh, I was going to put spruce. Oh, that's okay. Let's, let's do this. I'm going to still use the spruce here at the base. And that looks pretty good. Like I said, it doesn't have to be super fancy. Um, let's do a little bit more work to make the area look extra nice. I think I'm pretty happy with this, don't you? I had a little water area underneath it. Uh, put leaves around. Leaves make everything so much better. Uh, grass. Grass is still growing in, but... Uh, it's 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 there. You get the idea. <laughs> um, yeah, this it's a cool little monument, I think, to remember an area where honestly I felt like my building was taking a turn in this area. So that's the biggest reason uh, it's a shame that this area is lost. Um It was am an ambitious project. But, uh, you know, better suited for creative. Whether or not I could have done it, I think we'll all be happier watching a project like that get done in a few creative episodes instead of over a lot of survival episodes. I spent a lot of time working on that area. Um, that could have been done in a tenth of the time in creative. Anyways... That's pretty much it for this episode, everybody. We are back. Got new plans. Heading in new directions. In the future, we got new games. Just keep your eyes out for that. And thank you for watching. Welcome back, everybody. Thank you for coming back. I'll see you next time. Bye.